Hello everyone! This is me, this is Ben. Welcome to my channel. I am so excited to shoot this kahit sa akin lamang laptop ito ginagawa tonight because, well, I'm so busy. Hindi ko na kayang kunin yung camera ko sa baba and I just want to record and share the good news with you, everyone. So, if you will backtrack a bit, I recorded or I uploaded a video and I shared with you one of uh, the challenges that I encountered in the past weeks. Na medyo kainis because I was terminated and luckily I got a job, right? But that's not the good news kasi ulitin ko lang yun. But, okay, last week I received a message from my boss saying that they are increasing my pay. Okay, okay, disclaimer ha, I'm not here to brag. It's just that I am so happy and quite shocked about all the blessings that I'm receiving considering that it is pandemic. So, siguro lang sa akin, no, kung, kung nandiyan ka, kung nanonood ka and feeling mo walang direksyon tong pandemic and no one can thrive, no, 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 you're wrong. People can thrive even during the pandemic. Marami akong kilala na yung businesses nila, mas lalong lumago ngayon. Nagkaroon sila ng bagong businesses, in some cases. So, baguhin natin yung mindset na dahil may, may pandemic, eh, hindi tayo mag-thrive, or we cannot survive, or our business will go down. There are a lot of opportunities waiting out there. Now, speaking of opportunities, hindi pwede hinihintay mo lang yun, okay? While well, waiting for it, that time is very crucial. So, what are you going to do when you're waiting for that opportunity? As always, you have to prepare for it. In my case, dun sa short span of time that I needed to prepare for that opportunity, nagbasa-basa ulit ako. I tried to improve my writing, tried to see what went wrong, ano ba yung mga pangit, kailangan kong maguhin. Or if you have your resume, maybe brush it up, improve it, highlight your achievements, highlight your strengths. There are a lot of things that you can do during the waiting process. But I think the most important thing that I did at the time was to strengthen my faith. Sobrang yun yung nagpatatag sa akin. And hindi ako masyadong natakot kasi alam ko na hindi ako pababayaan. Yun lang talaga yung hinawakan ko. And because of that, even right now, and I kid you not, may mga bagay na feeling ko imposible. Pero dahil lumakas yung faith ko, alam ko na pwede siyang mangyari. Alam mo yung mga times na Siguro magkakaroon ako ng isang million next month. Yung mga ganun. And then, you will say, pa, no? But right now, you know, even if there are things that seem quite impossible, para sa akin, hindi na siya. Kasi, I am a living testimony na nagagawa niya ng paraan. Even this pandemic, na sinasabi nila, ang hirap makagawa ng vaccine. No, it is possible. And you just have to walk by faith, not by sight. Now, since I'm talking about improvement, self-improvement, I joined an online race. It's called online, or sorry, it's called Polar Online Race. Tama ba? Polar Online Race 2020. It's going to be a virtual race that will start on August 1 to 31. And you can register right now. Naglaps na yata yung early bird rate. But it's not as expensive as, you know, most runs. I will add a link somewhere here or maybe in the description. And that is why I'm a bit tan. I'm not so sure if my caller will register well sa camera. But yes, kaya din ako hindi nakapag-video is because I am too busy, number one, with work. And of course, I try to squeeze in 30 minutes to one hour of workout or training. Nagjajog ako sa labas. And you know, it's not just for me to improve physically or yung itsura. It's more of mental strength. Parang, ang saya kasi if, if you achieve something every now and then. And I think right now, more than ever, we also need to have small achievements in life. Kasi itong nagkaroon tayo ng stop sa ating mundo, tas parang feeling mo wala kang nararating. Yung mga gatong simple milestones, I think you should take advantage of it. Now, if you want to join, maybe you can click the link and pay online. Sobrang dali lang niya ay... I registered nine of my friends. And yeah, we're all joining. And my family as well. So I think that's about it. This is a short video. Apparently a very short video. I interviewed pala some of great moms. Some of the great moms that I know. I hope I have the time to edit it over the weekend. But yes, 
Thank you for waiting and thank you for watching. Don't forget to sub to subscribe, okay? Don't forget to subscribe. I'm bulol na. Bye bye.